New at 6, a test in the emergency room could determine if you have had a heart attack. The test is much quicker than what people are used to. Health editor Dr. Maria Simbra has more on how it works. In the emergency department, a faster test to tell if you're having a heart attack. The sooner you get in, the sooner we make the diagnosis, the better your outcome will be. Currently, doctors have a customary battery of tests. Uh, among them are heart tracings called EKGs, and then we also do blood tests. During a heart attack, heart cells go without blood and oxygen and die. In the process, they leak enzymes, among them one called troponin. With a troponin test, with the traditional test, it usually takes anywhere from three to six hours to be able to detect those abnormalities after the onset of symptoms. Checking for this enzyme is standard and takes several timed measurements. In a recent study from New Zealand, researchers looked at a new type of troponin, which could be used as a single blood test to figure out if you're having a heart attack or if you're not. In this study, they looked at a new test that they propose can detect an abnormality within 15 minutes of actually collecting that sample. The new test detects lower levels of troponin. It was accurate when compared to the standard old one, but the study involved only one hospital and 350 patients. And the field of cardiology is a very small study. This new test is only a research tool and larger studies will be needed before it's commonly used to diagnose heart attacks earlier. I think it potentially does have a very, very valuable role. I'm Dr. Maria Simbra, KDKA TV News.